Okay, so here's uh, one problem that you might run into. Uh, the caliper bolts are uh, very hard to take off. As you can see, usually you could do it by hand. I'm actually pushing off my knee and they still won't budge. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna heat them up and then use a longer breaker bar to give us more leverage. Since this is the rear brakes, we don't have the advantage of turning the knuckle and give us a, giving us a better angle. So uh, this is what we're gonna do. We're gonna heat it up for about two minutes and then use a longer breaker bar to break it off. So uh, we, won't, we don't want to damage this bushing, so we're just going to take it off. And set it to the side. Now we can go ahead and reheat this. Should be good enough. Now we're going to go ahead and use our breaker bar. And it should be free. Let's go ahead and try. There you go. Now we could go back, go back in with our regular ratchet, since now it's free. Now it's moving. And there you go, it's out. Just be careful, it's still hot gonna let it cool down and then uh, we're gonna do the same thing for the top one and uh, same procedure we're gonna heat it up for two minutes and then use a breaker bar to break it free and that's how you get out of um, this kind of problem where the bracket bolts are seized now the reason why they were super hard to take off is when you see some blue uh, markings it means it had some Loctite on it. And usually when you heat it up, you just want to um, kind of melt the Loctite, free it up, and then after that, you should be able to take it off. Depending on the make and model, um, they do come with Loctite from the factory. But uh, usually when you put it back, you don't have to put the... Uh, I usually don't put any. Um, just uh, snug them up, make sure they're tight and uh, you'll be good to go.